now my og og subscribers would know adolphus miller you know you know how this guy is you guys i put cops in a body bag i put gang members in a body bag i even put my own friends in a body bag and it's no different new city new rules but when you disrespect an og you get put in a body bag you get put in your place now over the last few weeks we've had a crazy stream of events and we'll be out here just you know grinding I was minding my business, my gang was minding our business, and because people had a few misunderstandings. We tired of playing with your ass, nigga. Today your ass is gonna die, bitch. Today we're gonna be meeting with the OGs of the other gangs, and we're gonna go ahead and put our foot down. We're gonna go ahead and make it very, very, very clear who runs self LS. You're not that guy, pal. Trust me. You're not that guy. Now, y'all know me. Y'all know, y'all know that I'm willing to compromise. I'm willing to you know make sure everybody's happy but as soon as i feel like i'm being slighted or i feel like i'm about to get attacked bravo six going dark it's on bro and you get y'all know y'all know i don't take shit i don't take disrespect i don't take none of that that goofy ad dude thing that people be coming up in bro pause that people be coming up with do you see me laughing my y'all know how i roll y'all know how i roll i got my boys with me i got things with me but I'm already, I'm already a demon on my own. Like, if I'd be a, on demon time sometimes, y'all. You know, we're gonna go ahead and meet up with these dudes, see what they gotta say, and see what we can make shaking. I got a few business things I gotta do in the next couple of weeks, so let's do this, y'all. You, you wanna buy yeah, this car? Up? Um, how much you selling it for? Well, since you're the homie, I'll sell for like a hundred, a hundred. Mm. Hold on, I gotta call. Hold on, hold on. Yo, Jay, what's up, man? Hey, what's going on? Yeah, uh, you heard the uh, PVE want to meet up? Uh, I'm looking at Murdy now. Yeah, I just seen that. You about yeah. to go? And I don't know. They tried to put me in a body bag, bro, last time. I don't know if I trust that shit. I mean, um, I don't know, man. It's a little sketch. I ain't going to lie. It's real sketch. I if mean, we meet anywhere, it, it got to be in a public place. You know what I'm saying? It gotta be in a somewhere like you know yeah it gotta be somewhere public like legion square or something i mean we we could do yeah we could do legion uh but like i, I i'm gonna bring my brother but i'm gonna have i'm gonna have my boys on standby real close you feel me yeah i i think i'm i'm about to do the same and uh i i ain't getting ambushed like that no more man like that shit that shit was crazy yeah nah facts though they did try to back you do you for no reason they should have just gave the car up yeah, like y'all, y'all are the ones that that f with us first. We put your boy in a body bag because he oh, wanted to be disrespectful that? to an OG. So nah, yeah. bro. Uh, well, yo, Keenan, I'm gonna uh, need you for for some. Uh, I'm gonna uh, I'm gonna get my boys together, and then we can meet at we can we could do Legion Square. I had them parked up in like the garage or some shit like that. All right, and bad, then we bad, see bad. what they trying to talk about. All right, I'll, I'll have my boys somewhere nearby. Uh, but. All right. All right. So, uh, then part boys, they want to meet up and talk business. Last time they tried to kill me. Yeah. Uh, I don't know if I trust it this time, but, uh, I okay. want y'all nearby in case something them? happened. They, I, I think they want to squash the beef when they, now that they know that we'd be dead, dead ass serious with them. Uh huh. So, um, so they want to, uh, you want to give me my AR? I think it's still uh, I don't think we have the AR anymore, to be quite honest with you. I'll give you the one yeah. that I have, though. Oh, you used up the ARs? Man, I got back home here, bro. I got back, I got back to the city, and, uh, uh all of them were gone. Like, the fuck? Can cops access this shit? Nah, I don't think so. Cause they did a on, they did an unlawful search here and there's a yeah I heard about that man we gonna be yeah. suing I, I bro I was there bro look I was I was driving past like so I was just like you know I got nah. I, I was my coke still in there I run, I was running from the cops over down here because I, I yeah. robbed the ATM and I had mad shit on me I was just gonna turn myself like just to get arrested probably but then I looked at my I looked at I had on me I had mad shit. I had two guns, I had drugs, everything. So yeah, that's crazy. I, I leave all the shit in the car. I put the car in the garage. And they say, 
Oh, they saw me go inside the bennies, and I didn't even go inside the bennies, and then they searched it. Uh, we we gonna be sweet though. We do a legit business in here, man. Oh, Don't mind I got, got coke in I here, got, but and I got arrested for some bullshit by this cop. Ooh, mm. got the baseball bat. All right, well, I'm gonna need y'all. So what's the plan here? We actually trying to squash the beef? We're like, well, well, I'm gonna try to get that car for you. Uh, the the that car that you want. You see this laser? Nah, I see uh I see a flashlight. Oh, cause I got, I have this uh uh weapons mod. Yo, this should look hard. I need to take a picture. I need to show this. All right. But uh yeah, so I'm gonna try to get that car for you. Um. Car. No go. The oh, car that they. Push? Nah. Oh, nah, nah. oh oh oh. The, the car the that they. That they yeah. And those yeah, someone be... just killed a guy. Those gonna be kind of my terms. They want tall business. Like we could talk business, but for right now, bro, like we ain't, we ain't, I ain't, I ain't with all that bullshit. You feel me, like? Yeah, 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 yeah. Hey, uh, Kino. Good. Yeah. Can you pick me up from the airport? I need to go put the helicopter back in the hangar. Uh, I got you. I'm gonna need y'all right, to so be nearby in now? case I call. Uh, I'm gonna go get my car and change my clothes up. Yeah. So you guys, you guys, so if. Sorry, sorry, nah, you guys, you guys go ahead and do what you gotta do, and uh, meet back here in like ten minutes, and then I'll, uh, I'll, I'll text them back and be like, yeah, we can meet up. Uh, huh. gotcha. Send me up. Wait, you don't got my phone. Here, my phone number. All right, let me, yeah, let me get phone. yours. Wait, yeah, do yeah, I got yeah. Your phone number, Keenan. Uh, yeah, I got you. <gasps> Forgot we all got iPhones now. Oh yeah, shit, a spy. Go live on IG. Lit. Yeah, I'm gonna go get my car real quick. Yo. Who owns this place? You scared the hell out of me, bro. Who runs this place? Who asking? Who runs this place? Who asking? What you need to know for? Oh, I I just need to know. I need to talk to him. Who asking? Yo, shut up and shit. Who asking? I'm looking for a guy named uh, to whoever runs Benny's. And I'm asking you who asking. What you need to know for? Jenkins? Jenkins. You Jenkins? Is it, it, it you, you, you Tyrone? Tyrone Jenkins? Nah, man, I'm not Tyrone. So who are you, man? Tyrone's my dad. How we know Tyrone's your dad? You're gonna have to start saying some words. Oh man. shit! Really you do look name. like that nigga, bro. Like goddamn, uglier than a motherfucker. Crazy. But yeah, he died yesterday. Oh really? Yeah. yeah. Who killed him? <clears throat> I'm not sure. That's why I'm, that's why I'm here to find out. Oh, I feel mm, like I know who us. did. Oh, it wasn't me. I was out. I was out. I had a trip. I'm, li I'm looking for whoever killed my dad. It, it, it's the park boys. I know who did it because they had him kidnapped and we were trying to look for him. Oh, really? Yep. Give me a second. I ain't get my gun out of my car. Oh. All right. You want to pick what up you need a gun for airport? Yeah, what you need a gun for, bro? What you need a gun for? You know, what you need a gun for, bro. They're not, they not just gonna kill my pops and get away with it. Okay. Nah, okay. chill out, chill out, man. Hey, don't do it. Y'all, y'all handle y'all business. Yo, can I help you, bro? Yeah. Um, <clears throat> after my father died, I I got everything that he owned before. Um, you guys, you guys had a some sort of an agreement or something, because uh, I know that he kept saying, you know. If something did happen to me that you're cool people yeah we were we were cool we had a common enemy the the, the little part boy little boys see me i wasn't here i keep hearing that name yeah it's another gang keep trying to do you know trying to do stuff me and your dad we were cool we were trying to you know just trying to do business doing doing what you got to do he controls his boys we control ours you know, just mutual respect kind of kind of thing. But uh, I don't really want to get into it too 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 much. But uh, yeah, we we just you know we just chilling. 
And then the part boys decided to, to attack your dad and screw some of our boys. One of them punched me in the face. So we had um, that that one that one that punched me in the face. You, you know, he, he's he's no longer here. That's the best I can tell you. All right. You know what they've been hanging out at? As for who killed your dad? I don't know. I don't know. You might got to go ahead and ask the guys from your that your, that your dad be rolling with. They might know. Yeah, they said Park Boys. All right. Well, I know they got a record studio near your dad's shop, and uh, they got a they got a, a nice little mechanic shop in La Mesa. <clears throat> uh, <clears throat> yeah, materials to make a fire. To make a fire. Yeah. Nah. I uh, I ain't got nothing like that. All right, let me get your contact then. I don't usually I don't usually handle the uh you know the, the business the, the stuff out here. I just make I just you know chilling. I'm a humble business owner. Respect that. Well I'ma head out and look for those park boys. Alright, well good luck. Don't get killed, man. I'm too young to be out here doing all this. Uh I'm not that young. I'm only twenty three. Uh, you you still a little kid, still young. Huh. Hey, can you open this? Appreciate it, man. All right, man, he's looking for his ad killer. Y'all hear me? What's up? All right, how far y'all at? Cause uh, I'm about to head out to the. Seven five nine. I think I see two park boys at the closest. They are where? Uh, all of them? Nah, meet me at around the. Where? Go and, go and see what these uh these par boys want to talk about. Yeah, meet me at uh meet me at the Fleeking Bank. You got your guns right? Where yeah. Frank at? Are they coming here? Yeah, we said we gonna, we, we, gonna we said we gonna only meet them in public. Bro, I'll kill the motherfucker in public. I don't care. You want me to go up hey. on the roof of that building? If he, hey, if he doesn't give my car back, I'm killing him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Go up on the roof. You got a, you got a, you you got a rifle or something. Lot? Yeah, I got an AR. Are you guys gonna meet in the parking lot? Cause if you meet in the parking lot, I got a good spot. I got a sniper if you want it. Nah, nah, no snipers. What we gonna do? We can probably meet in the park in the middle Legion Square. Oh, I don't. There's not a good building there. I already know for a fact. I know one. Hop in. Hop in. Hop in. Nodestar LLC is a premium Windows VPS service that offers virtual service for all of your needs. Nodestop has been the platform for which DVRP uses to host all of our service. They are extremely fast, reliable, and they have excellent customer service on all of their services. Nodestop offers all kinds of deals on different ISPs as well as you can do custom orders to fit whatever you want. If you guys are ever in the market for a VPS, click my link in the description down below for a discount on any of your purchases on their website. Now let's get back to the video. Yo, bro. Yeah, yeah sorry, my, my audio was glitched. Right. Huh? You see your car's parked? Yeah, I see it. Who this right here? Who this right here? Dolphin. Who this? 
four or five. I'm saying it, it's three of y'all. Who, who the leader and who the lieutenant? A uh. It should, it should really be two and two. A O key. Go ahead. Yeah. I mean, it's over by. Just go over by the car. Appreciate that. Like, like I was telling the boys, and I'm gonna start off by, you know what I'm saying, telling you too. Like, I mean, you ain't got no reason to trust us. At the same time, we ain't got no reason to trust y'all, regardless of how the last meetup went. You know what I'm saying? The streets been crazy, the streets been hectic. You know what I'm saying? Everybody lost something, whether it was big or small. Blood has been shed on all three sides. Like, you know what I'm saying? But at the end of the day, everybody here got shit that they need to take care of, people they need to take care of. And you can't constantly do that as a man, you know what I'm saying, looking over your shoulder and constantly don't know, you know what I'm saying, what day going to be your last day. So, I mean, this ain't no no whole shit. We ain't copping no plea, no no none of that, you know what I'm saying, because we, we know we signed up for when we started the street shit. So we ain't running from nothing. But as a leader, you know what I'm saying, it's shit that need to be, you know what I'm saying, hashed out and ended so that everybody can put their people in a position to succeed and be successful and also take care of their family. So like I said, y'all lost shit, we lost shit, and all that shit can end here if, if y'all want it to. Like, you know what I'm saying, we ain't, we ain't denying anything we ever done, you know what I'm saying? We owning up to it, and y'all got y'all get back for it, and we got some get back. So now I feel like we at a place where we can all walk our separate ways as long as we ain't stepping on each other's toes, you know what I'm saying, talking crazy, doing no other Man, bullshit, I feel like we'll be straight out here. That's that's the same shit y'all came up in here, dude, bro. Like, I I own the entire South Side. Y'all come up in here, your boy was talking mad crazy. I pressed him about it. He got real disrespectful, bust up my lip. That wasn't even the the the, the, the worst part of it. I gotta be hearing from my boys that y'all messing with him. So, so, and and on top of that, y'all still owe him a car. What you gonna say about that? Y'all owe him a car. So, I I don't know shit about the car personally. I don't I don't do no racing or none of that shit. So I don't know shit about that. And I ain't seen KP since you know what i'm saying all that shit happened and you know he upstairs now so i can't get no information on that shit. you know what i'm saying so i i don't feel responsible for you know what i'm saying having to give y'all a, a car or you know what i'm saying because i don't know shit about that and there's no way we can get the car anyway because that was his personal shit, and i'm not his family member so the feds wouldn't give me shit. Uh, that he owned or anything like that. So I have no access to that. On the other shit I can speak on was I respect how you, ain't no man gonna put their hands on me. So he was out of line for, you know what I'm saying, talking shit, popping shit, which, I mean, you can't control nobody's mouth, but he put his hands on you and you felt yeah. he did what you needed to do. He didn't but know where he was at. That's the problem. Yeah. He didn't know where he was at. I mean, but we never seen y'all before. Like, we never came in contact with y'all. That was the first time. So how are we just supposed to automatically, you know what I'm saying, know where we at, especially when we change the clothes. Like, we can't we can't change clothes over there. Like, you know what I'm saying? It shouldn't even be that that petty of a situation. Like Everybody around here knows where the four or five, where the four or five go. Everybody know I, I, where, where who goes dog, around the four or five. So, if you're so going to be saying, in the area, make sure that when uh, another person, especially somebody flying a tag, presses you, you don't you don't come up in here and straight up disrespect a person who's walking around here slipping off at, a, at random people you feel me like that kind of thing i feel like that's common sense that's like that's like that's like knowledge right there you you guys been on the, the street time, dog, you don't come up in control, here you can't control the genetic makeup of somebody if somebody's a hot head they're just a hot head it ain't nothing you can do about it and, and i can do about and it that's what, we can try and that's where you control, get but at the same time though like when niggas is young and just out here green in the streets like it's gonna take time like, it's gonna work with them. like you're gonna have to have these situations like you know what i'm saying for them to see and understand like how you need to mature how you need to move so at the, at the same time like i respect what you're saying but you also got to understand is you ain't that man daddy you ain't that man nothing so you can't i ain't gotta be his daddy to talk to, but talk to i'm gonna be the man who who covers that area 
and if i'm over there i run shit around there and if i come up in there and i say something and he wants to get the respect i got all rights in my my i got all authority to sit down there and check him and as you soon do, as he do. wants to as soon as he wants to get a real thing he can he can go ahead and get checked but at the end of the day a debt still needs to be paid and a debt ain't even paid yet the debt was his life though and i ain't yeah. dying a debt that's my debt that's not the debt that's not the debt to my boy back there that's oh, the debt to me is, 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 so is war is war with losing more men worth it worth the car and some money nah it's not even just about the car and some money it's about the respect respectfully we're trying to we're trying to squash the whole thing exactly so that's respect why we we're respecting y'all enough to come here right now and accept that we lost a life and y'all ain't really losing nothing but a car that y'all if y'all if y'all really like want to squash the stuff y'all gonna though, give us go what get, we owed you can go get that but i can't that i i can't give you a car that i don't own my guy like i, I just can't do that, that. Like, you ain't gotta give me I, a car that you own. I, I I just want a car. I want a charger. My boy out there want it fair and square. If y'all if y'all well, don't want to produce right, well, it, then that's where we at. But I didn't start this so war. We keep, so we I didn't start this war. Your boy started this war. So you have to end, end it. it. Somebody somebody that's not here that that has nothing to do with anything anymore. He okay, got what he deserved. Yeah, like but he was gone. flying. But he was flying your colors, right? That's he's correct. A, and yeah, and he's a representation of you. The and same and way, now, how if one of these guys did some, it's my responsibility to take care of that that too because we are family. That's what, who we are. That's how we roll. So if yeah. if if y'all ain't wanna right, wanna listen, do listen, nothing listen, about listen, it, bro, listen, no, ain't no listen, bro. Ain't right no now, listen. All y'all doing is talking and talking and talking, and you ain't even listening. That's what I mean. It's for to talk, like. We trying to squash the beef, and you talking about a car when you killed the man that ran off with the car, disrespected you, so you got justification. You took the man's life. He's no longer here. That's something that in the streets is a trophy. I think Quite any frankly, real, I think any real nigga, any real gangster will take taking the nigga's life for disrespecting <laughs> him and his organization over a fucking car that he lost. And respect, you know what I'm saying? I ain't, the car ain't got nothing to do with me. The debt that that. that I got from taking his life was from the disrespect that he did to me personally. My boy back there didn't get none of that. He ain't get none of that. Family, you should have handled that for him, right? Yeah, but if we, that's exactly what I'm doing now, and that's why I'm getting the car. That's why I'm getting the car. We'll come up with some bread and give him the bread so he can get a charger, but we can't produce a charger that we don't own or have. So that's my solution to, to that car shit. But I ain't even worried about the car shit. The bigger, the bigger deal is, you know, what I'm saying the war, and that's what we're trying to get. The past. issue is that y'all bought y'all bit off a lot more than y'all can chew. You didn't know, you didn't know what was going even, on. You didn't even know what was going on. That's not really, that's not really the case. Again, yeah, right. I'm trying to. Um, you can talk and say whatever you want to say, bro. Like, like I said, I came here to keep the peace. You can keep sneak this in and and. Ain't, ain't nobody sneak yeah, this ain't nothing day, it's the, the truth the y'all came oh, up in here y'all came up in here with two anymore. established that's gangs you decided to want to go ahead and disrespect one of the ogs it doesn't matter if it was it was kp or whatever the hell his name was it doesn't matter if it's you it doesn't matter if it's you y'all are all wearing the same colors you came up in here right, right now. you came so up in here you came up in here with two established gangs who were cool with each other we weren't even partnered or anything we were but just cool like, we were two we were cool know. with each other and oh, then oh, y'all came up in here and y'all wanted to stir up all kind of trouble now you want to squash it now to me that well, sounds kind of crazy uh, bro let, let me say something real quick um you know you say that your people are hotheads this kp dude he he said he did one thing we let him slide he did another thing, we let him slide. And then the third time, we got retaliation. You tried to rob two people twice on two occasions. Rob people? Yep. And, and then, then gang, you got lippy. I'm gonna let you, I'm gonna let you finish in a minute. We, so, we, don't, we don't know anything about that, okay? I understand. I'm, I'm just I'm saying only, that your I'm point I'm only head that, now because KP is gone. So it's yeah, a lot of stuff. Gone, so I'm it's a lot of stuff that, y'all keep. Exactly, I know. it's a lot of what stuff I'm that we don't understand. What I'm saying is that you brought up. You brought up that you can't can't control when people are hotheads, but you you know it happened multiple times, which means you guys were aware of it when you could have handled it. But y'all chose to continue. Y'all settled it. 
y'all settled it. So what we're saying now is we can control the peace. We can all keep each other in contact and reach out to each other when one of our boys are acting out of line. I've like, heard like, multiple. I don't heard multiple stories about y'all in purple doing reckless shit too. So it's not like y'all are just the 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 angels around here cleaning up the streets. We didn't have to be because at the end yeah. of the day, this is our shit. All of this is our shit. It's not about y'all knew. Y'all knew. Who's, this is our shit. You came up in. You came up in. You came up in our our shit. And you decide you gonna violate, and then and then now when we're the bigger gang, the one that that controls the shit wants to rain down fire on y'all, y'all decide you know well, let me put my hands up and be like yeah let's let's squash the beef. Nah, bro, right, I ain't me, about that. I ain't let about all that, bro. bro. Let me ask you a question. What you, I'm you, about you, is that if you, you wanna if you wanna, wanna squash fire, right? things, if you wanna squash things, you gotta go. You gotta come up in here and be like yeah. We know that we effed up. We know that this dude just, effed up. Nah, no, nah, no, chill, bro. Like, let me finish, bro. You ain't letting me finish. That's the problem here. Y'all effed up, and then on top of that, y'all just wanna, y'all just wanna. Oh, my bad. Y'all apologize and then say that just because we kill him means that that's that squash. That ain't no squash, bro. I kill hell of people. That ain't got nothing doing on this. If I say I want the car, I want the compensation for the car. It's compensation for the car. My boy got slighted. I got slighted. I took care of my business. I'm taking care of his. And his stuff is something completely separate to what I got. And again, I'm telling you, if we don't own the car, the most we can do is give you the damn money for the car and he can go buy it. That proposition was already out there. So on that car shit, you can take that or leave it. But that's all we can do. That's the only amend we can make for the car. We don't own the car. And again, if you the leader of the four five, can can he tell you what to do? Can who tell can me what to do? Your lieutenant tell you what your lieutenant. Can he tell Heck you what nah. to do? Okay, so that's the case with KP. Okay. He was the leader. All right, we had to fall in line. Whatever so decision what? he made, he was the leader. He was able to no, be that no, and nobody questioned be because we stayed into our road. So anything that happened is because our leader needed it out. to happen or wanted it to happen. So again, right. now that he's gone, so we're here. Because, I'm because in place the leader did his stuff. A different way. Okay, listen, bro, I let you talk so you can let me talk. Again, so this is my way of trying to lead and restore <sighs> order inside of the organization. I just admitted everything that happened. Okay, I never said that we we didn't do anything. That was the first couple of things I said. Even to them boys, you can ask them boys over there. I admit it. I said we did what we did, and that's everybody did what they did. So ain't nobody trying to act like we we ain't throwing no rocks and hiding no hands here. Like I just admitted that. I put it on the floor. Like you know what I'm saying. So what I'm trying to say is now I'm in charge. So now I can do shit how I want to do it and see fit to do it. And this was the first order of business in changing shit and changing the dynamic of everything. So this is the respect that you're talking about. I'm respecting you as you running shit and you the leader and, and all that. Same with them boys over there. And I'm trying to talk leader to leader. Like, let's let's be on the same page. All right, everything that happened has happened. We can put it in the past. You want compensation for the car? All right, we'll try to get up some money, enough money, money, much money we can get because we don't got access to KP funds, like none of that shit. So whatever so, we can get to give you, maybe that'll help them get the car so or whatever. But physically, hold on, bro. Hold on, bro. But physically, we cannot give you a car that we don't own or we don't have. So again, moving forward, it ain't got nothing to do with nobody being no pussy, no bitches, no none of that. We just trying to go in a different direction. I am because I'm in charge of this shit now. And this is my first order of business and cutting all this shit out. So motherfuckers get to their money and mind their business. And then if another situation happen, then it can be taken care of however it need to be taken care of. We take the money. That's what I'm I'm more worried about. Is either the car or the money. And as long as he gets his compensation for the shit, the sneaky shit that KP did, I'm cool with that. But right, as I said, but as I said, I got, it's all about I got, that. I got a, I got a Hellcat y'all can have. I I got a brand new Hellcat y'all can have, bro. If that means we can settle the beef, cause listen, I'm quite I've only been out here two weeks, bro. I've only been here two weeks, man. I flew out here to, to to support my pops on his grand opening. I ain't even had a chance to settle down with that shit. Cause it's the first day I come out here, some dudes representing 45s slapped me in the face with a note 
talking about my, my big cousin's been killed. Imagine how I feel with that. So oh, I imagine respect. how you feel about that. My brothers no, got killed the same way by the KTG. Sure. But at the end of the day, but at the end of the day, you still got to come up. You still got to understand where, you're, where, where the other I, gang's I wanna, coming from. I wanna, listen, I respect. I want to, I, I personally... Someone who's who's been it, who who's been forced to dive into this head first, the street shit head first. Respectfully, I would give y'all a car, if that's what it means to settle the beef. Yeah. Right. Just you give cool us a time. That? Just give us a time. Right, and I'm place, cool bro. with that. All right. So what what about what about y'all boys? So so what's what's, what's on the floor with y'all? Because we had a whole separate situation than them. Like you know what I'm saying. So. <laughs> We, we I'll take I'll take the, the, the money and the or the, the car. What's, what's good with y'all? <laughs> Yo. You get me now? Yeah, I can hear you. I you know what I'm saying? I mean, you know, your your boy KP. You know what I'm saying? It all started with him. Pretty sure I just started with Fofa. You know what I'm saying? I wanted to rob my brother in the bank. As he was trying to make, you know, transaction shit, and then it just went on from there. You know what I mean? You know, he got whatever happened to him, happened to him. You know what I mean? There was a bunch of retaliation for a bunch of shit that happened. But, you know what I'm saying? As y'all know, I'm all about the money. If y'all willing to cool y'all shit out, I tell my niggas to cool they shit out, and then we carry it on from there. But I ain't about to sit here and then let y'all fuck with us and then think that shit about to slide, you feel me? Yeah, I respect that, dog. And it, and it, like I said, it's the same way. It's a two way street. Like any in, in, any nigga, if you if you a real man and call yourself a man, the nigga step step out of line. Like you gonna take care. Of it. That's with anybody. So again, K KP ain't here no more. All right, we cleaning up all his shit. So again, I'm in charge. Smoke. All right, I'm in charge now. But this is how I want to do shit. All right, so we can start off on a fresh slate. You know what I'm saying? We can what's good like if y'all want to kick it ever do business whatever moving forward as as the, the smoke die down or whatever that's cool like we we with that you know what i'm saying but if a nigga ever get out of line i would like for moving forward if if niggas at the clothing store and they pop a shit to you like you you about to have my number hey yo smoke you need to get your your young boy or whoever the fuck this is up here talking shit okay i pull him to the side take care of it if he does it after that whatever help However, you retaliate after that, and whatever else happens, then we'll take care of it from there. But at least give me a chance at first to take care of the situation, instead of it just escalating right there. That's that's all I'm trying to be on. Mm, all right. I can respect them. So so uh, what's what's your name, Big Dog? Four or five? You could just call me Mill. Mill. Yeah, Mill. All right. So we give us about. 10, 15 minutes to go to go get this car and shit. If you want to just wait right here or whatever, we'll bring it yeah, wherever you, could, you at. We'll, can meet us over there. All right, we'll, we'll bring, garage the, over we'll there. Bring the, we'll bring the car back to you. All right. So we uh, so we all straight. Everybody good. Be chill. I'm uh, I'm gonna make sure my boys know. All right. All right. We got a we got a decent resolution. Uh, y'all be easy, man. Yeah, you too, man. Got some, uh, I got a shipment of cars coming soon. Oh, yeah? Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. You, you gonna get your car. What kind of car oh, y'all got? Yeah. Um, I'm thinking, uh, it, I, I, I know there's like one or two Lambos coming through. And, uh, mm -hmm. yeah, there's one or two coming through pretty soon, probably in like a week or so. And then, uh, I believe. There is gonna be a, a G wagon. Clear out, meet at the shop. It's gonna be a Where's G wagon. I want to buy those. Uh, probably in a week. Right. If he goes, if he go, if he goes. All right, but I will look uh, when those come in. Just uh, just let me know. I'm gonna take right. a look at all my buy songs. All right, bet. I got. I got, right, I, I got some of those right, stuff yeah. coming in. I gotta, I gotta get a truck going though, cause uh, shit, mental well, out here. Right. You yeah, got your yeah, own dealership, yeah. bro? Nah, he got oh, the dealership, but we'll oh. sell it. We'll sell it to them if they want to get oh. a supply. Oh yeah, for sure. Uh, so 
Um, as I said, else. I just I just signed some with with Lambo, so we gonna we gonna we gonna get those in. All right, bet for sure. Well, you got my number. Just hit me up when you get those in, and then you know what I'm saying we'll talk business, all right? All right, no problem, man. Uh, y'all boys be yeah, stay blessed. Go, kill nigga. All right, let's go. Oh, let's go, my car. Get we gonna we gonna make them over here. They gonna give you the car. Better be fully upgraded too. This shit ain't matched up. I ain't, I ain't taking it. So we got that car. trying to stop that nigga from pulling up on y'all. Okay, well, the right, put a gun on us and hit behind the car ready to shoot it. From our nah, position. Nah, they, they know. We, we already told them what it was. They ain't on that. If they is, then we'll handle it. All right. I'm about to, I'm about to drop y'all boys my number so we can so we can have a direct line to each other. Mm-mm-mm-mm-mm. <laughs> You got it. If y'all want to do business, what 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 y'all got? Cause uh, might need some. We might need to get some uh some shit moved between here, between Polito and down to the city. Yeah, I got that shit. Nah. Yeah, I got that shit. All right, bet. You you got that shit, uh, Mio. You and Mari. You and Mari? I know y'all niggas ain't. Yeah, I'm a Mari right here, y'all. In the gold jacket. All right, I got smoke. All right, bet. So what, what? What kind of business you were talking about? Matter of fact, we'll chop it up when you bring when we bring you the car back. We about to go get it right now. Nah. All right. All right. Hey, they pulled up with their guns out. Who that? Uh, passenger over there. Passenger over here. First passenger of the bananas. Oh. Uh, they good, man. I don't, I don't if if they try anything then, you know, it's war from there. Yeah. I just want I don't wanna die to make it start a war. Yeah, I got you. My mother if y'all lie to him or my mom. Oh. On everything I love, if y'all niggas lie and said that it was me, y'all niggas getting beat, bro. Get out of the car. What you mean, dog? <laughs> what you mean, fam? All I did was at the light. I said, "Yo, fam, which one? Wh 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 who killed my dad?" Let Let me talk. No, like, no, I'm not. No, no BS. No, like, seriously. I, I went up to like, ass, hey, dog. Who killed my dad? <laughs> and these niggas pull up behind me, okay. hop out with an AR to the back jumped. of my car, and this start pointing at get his ass beat. Hey, oh boy. I'm not. I told y'all, dog. We we. I told you, bro. I told y'all, fam. I I just wanted to know who killed my dad. I ain't. I ain't. I ain't looking for vengeance. Shut the fuck. Hey, shut the fuck up. Go to the shop. Fuck your car, bro. We can't leave it right here. Hey, y'all be easy. Don't do it. Yeah, man. Man, fuck twelve, bro. Yo, y'all follow me.
them to pull in. Are you here yet? Where are you at? Yeah, I'm here. Uh, we're at the parking lot still. Uh, Hellcat's here. Eyes on. Eyes right. on. Down my car. Yeah, yeah. Yo, so y'all gotta oh, store it and then transfer it to his name. You said we gotta store it, then transfer yeah. it to his name? Yeah, yeah. you gotta store it in the garage and then transfer it to his name. Alright, so let's say you gotta uh, store it, then transfer it. Alright. You can store it right up here. How we going? Gotta, How we going? You can start right up here. Just like right here. Yeah, I think that's where I think that's where you going. Ah. Uh, how how we going? Uh, know his name? Like, as long as he near or something. Uh, yeah, yeah. Uh, Jackson, look for Jackson. Uh, you you click on it like you about to uh get it out and then, and then you transfer, transfer and then look look for Jackson. Make sure uh, Keenan drives it before we let him leave. That way he knows it's upgraded or not. Yeah, that shit better, gone, nah, Jackson, that shit better uh, be the Littleford? same one that was before. Nah. Jackson, Keenan Jackson. Keenan Jackson. Uh, Keenan Jackson. You said yeah, Keenan? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Keenan Jackson. Yeah. I'm just saying, the car that I raced had nitrous in it. This car better had nitrous in it. See, we ain't. See, nah, we, we ain't. We ain't. I don't know get... all that. Hey, bro, I'll get you straight, bro. Don't worry about it. Hey, bro, I just, uh, this is my car, bro. I'm giving it to you, bro. I got it. Let me just test there it. There you go, bro. All right. All right. I think that's good. I got it. Look, make sure, just check for it. Pull it out. Make sure you, you straight. So you, I mean, you need to make sure. All right. Oh, yeah. yeah that's good. Yeah. Yeah, we're good. All right, y'all, 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 right. straight. 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 What? What's that? What's that business you were talking about, though? Yeah, I got, I got some, uh, I got a shipment coming good. in pretty soon. I don't know if y'all want to get in on it. You just gotta keep the cops off for us. Just uh, yeah. When it when they get in, just call my phone and we can talk uh details and shit. Like I said, we trying to move forward and shit. So just let us know. All right. Well. We um, I got a shipment of uh of stuff coming in. It's not it's not drugs nor nothing like that. It's some a little bit more legit, but not legit at the at this at the same time. And right. uh, and uh, we gonna be selling it to the other gang, but I need help moving it. And uh, the cops might be all over us, so we gonna have to we gonna have to move real covert. Uh, yeah, like I said, man, whenever you get in, just, just hit my phone, uh, get the detail. Yeah. Alright, no problem. All right, you are now in the presence right. of a...